They got swarmed by those little beasts. I think they're called Canucks. I hope this mission is worth it to the Colonel. If not, wait, did you hear that? That's him! Get him! Set the staging camp up here. This jungle just never ends. Lieutenant, two of our scout patrols haven't reported back. Do more? Nothing is worth this. More beasts! Everyone, attack!
Jungle is a living thing. That detonation will have repercussions. Thank <laughs> you. 
Blaster rifle fire coming from deeper in the jungle. You find anything? I'm surprised they wouldn't talk to you. I thought their grudge was only with Mandalorians. Find out anything useful from them? Colonel, huh? Could be Colonel Tobin. Tobin is General Vaklu's personal cat hound. If he's on your trail, you might want to steer clear of Onderon. I'm not surprised. He was probably acting on orders from Vaklu. If so, you've made some dangerous enemies. General Vaklu is the cousin of Queen Talia. He's also in charge of the Onderon military. He led the Onderon resistance when we occupied their world during the Mandalorian Wars. He was a worthy foe. Maybe more than a match for you. Mandalore needs to know about the scouts. I'll let him know your role in dealing with them. They're Onderon military, although they were trying to be secret about it. I've got a feeling you're going to need all the help you can get. One last thing about the battle circle. Your actions have proven you worthy of facing our best in the circle. Perhaps we can face each other there. See you at camp.
Wait a moment. Do you see that boma over there? The force flows through even these simple creatures. If you empty your mind, you may be able to feel its thoughts. They aren't fully formed. Basic instincts, urges, dominated by every breath and every moment, primal and unsophisticated. Good. Beasts can be easier to affect than other sentients, but you must bridge the gap between what distinguishes us and them. You feel its consciousness, yes, like a low rumble before the storm. Use the force to create a barrier around it. Make it with care and subtlety.
Yes? out into the jungle. Stay alert.
to head back to your ship? Give the... I hear you gave Davril a warrior's death. You understand more of our ways than I thought. I'm impressed. Too bad you're a Jedi. You'd make a formidable Mandalorian. Our sensors picked up three ships. If any of the Onderon military come searching for those... I don't know. It was some sort of freighter, knowing some of the larger Duxan beasts. The people of Onderon still live in fear of us. They were there resi if they knew we were here. Any progress with the repairs or the phase pulse converter? That's the best thing I've heard in weeks. I'll be sure to tell Matt. Look, I have some extra parts and computer spikes. Take them. Any progress with... You do? Let me see. I don't know how, but these pieces look in good enough shape to repair. I'll have the telemetry computer repaired in no time. I'll be sure to tell Mandalore how much help you've been. I know you didn't ask, but here's a reward anyway. Mandalorians are expected to do anything they can to help, but you're a strange... The Onderon military has stepped... They're blockading any Republic... Don't kill Mrs. Barney yet. If he couldn't defend himself, then he got no less than he deserved. Any sign of that permacrete he was carrying? Send a new recruit out sooner than I'd like. Shame about that permacrete. No. Lorians will rise again. Melbourne says you are worthy enough to face champions. You may fight in the battle circle again. You have enough honor to face a champion of a previous day. Kelborn, what are your terms? Swords only. No items or the Jedi's force. And no sword of the Jedi's choosing. Just a simple long blade. Kelborn chooses to fight with the blade. You may fight with fist, foot, and the blade provided. No using the force or any other item. Kelborn is over. The Jedi is the clear and honorable victor. I underestimated you. A difficult admission for a Mandalorian. If you fight in the circle again this day, you will face the bravest and strongest of us, Braylor. <laughs> or to participate. We eagerly look forward to this fight. Braylor, you are our champion. How would you fight the Jedi? No terms today, Sergeant. I would fight the Jedi with all of his arsenal. Braylor will fight you as you are. Still no killing and no leaving the battle circle. But you may use whatever else you want.
Jedi and Braylor is over. The Jedi is the clear and honorable victor. You have defeated the most worthy of us. You walk away the champion of the battle circle this day. We will not forget your deeds or the honor you have earned this day. Yes. That crystal is bonded to you through... Let me focus on the crystal for a moment. There. Now it is fully in tune with you again. Is there something else you... That crystal is... Should your power increase... Is there... Ignorance. And... Do not let them discover what makes you. Because you learned to live without the Force. 
and that is something that the galaxy asks. Either you're very lucky, or you're a lot tougher than you look. Kelborn said you dispatched some covert military scouts in the jungle with him. He spoke highly of your work. Zuka told me you helped out with some repairs around the base. I was hoping you'd prove yourself more with a lightsaber, but it's certainly a great help. The gate guard said you managed to kill a Zakig. Those are tough beasts, Jedi. You've earned some respect around here. How many Kanoks did you have to kill to find those parts for Zuka? That was a tremendous help. I won't forget it. You've made quite a reputation around here. You did better than I thought you could. I was planning on heading to Isis tomorrow, but I'll move up the timetable and take you now. You won't be able to get to the Ebon Hawk from the city. If you need to grab anything from your ship, I'd do it now. I know, it made quite a racket. Good work. That's to be expected. They don't really like it when someone makes loud noise in their territory. It wouldn't be much of a test if all you had to do was take a hike through the jungle, now would it? You're alive, in one piece, and learn something about the beasts of the jungle. Are you ready to go to Isis yet? Kelborn told me that they were covert military and probably aligned with Colonel Tobin from ISIS. Kelborn doesn't think they'll send out any more scouts, but that doesn't mean there aren't more of them out there. Colonel Tobin is General Vaclu's right-hand man. Despite his martial skill, he handles himself as a functionary more than a warrior. Back when we were fighting Vaclu's resistance during the Mandalorian Wars, Vaklu wouldn't have any use for a poisonous Kenrath like Tobin. But Vaklu seems to have adapted well to peacetime. When you were last here, you probably didn't even go to Onderon. The Republic to begin with. It depends on who you ask. Queen Talia rules from the Royal Palace, but her cousin General Vaklu has a great... They disagree about many things. We're not self-sufficient here. We need supplies. Isis is the only place to go, which is unfortunate. Be I don't blame you. There is... Oh. Scouts reported...